So yes, congratulations to Nigeria. Congratulations to Nigeria for winning the boat for boat challenge with against South Africa. Yes, congratulations. So we won. We show them that you cannot mess with Nigerians. Yes. Uh, okay. Even though, in my opinion, this was a very insignificant battle that has no impact on anybody's lives, but we won it, right? Good. But this just shows that it means that we, as a people, as young people, we can change the narrative if we want to. We can change where our country is if we want to. And it's not about going to the streets to protest. It's not by everybody going online to go and protest. Hey, no. Joe means that we just can organize ourselves online with our platforms with our phones and demand certain things you know it's not about all of us going out to go and protest hey if we can force you know boards to to take certain decisions as regards the operations in this country just means that imagine what two million three million of us will do with our phones tweeting or talking about a particular issue or demanding for a particular thing just imagine if so many of us can say, you know what, there's this particular thing that is not good in our country, once it's fixed, and we tweet, 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 or we post, 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 or we do videos, do videos, do videos, do videos. Just so that there's so much we can do as a people when we you, you are united and when we come together to, to do stuff, like what we did to show the South Africans, right? But like I said, things like this that really have no economic, will not really impact the, the, um, the value of your our lives is that it's things like this that we put so much energy in i'm not saying we shouldn't do it we should do it but I, I just i just wish we can channel this same energy into issues that are affecting our our everyday lives example this is our first situation you know that's just me my two cents peace